Hello guys, we have a turntable from Florence, one box, it's the brand new TD1500, it's designed in Germany and manufactured in Taiwan, so we have the same configuration here as other turntables, box in the box, now the white one. Here uh, we are with the second box, uh, designed the ton arm in Germany, we're gonna examine it, so this is a box guide, it's underneath has a symbol, the logo of Florence. So on top, we can see the operational manual, the quick start guide. This is the cover, dust cover. So it's inside here. The actual product is already there. So this is a ten table, and then in the box we have the platter, play the mat, aluminum platter here, and the cartridge alignment protractor here to help you to you know to adjust your ten table properly. And then here we have a power supply which is external. You can upgrade this if you like with a better one always helps to receive better sound and then there is another bag that has the added counter weight for the tone arm adapter for 45 uh, rpms what else the belt itself a uh, hinge for the cover second one so let's start the installation. So first we unbox the platter, which is aluminum, as you can see. With uh, the shaft goes here, there are two holes here, one to, to adjust the belt if you like, and to find the, the screws for the springs in order to adjust the height and to align the level of... Uh, Unpack comes with a cartridge, orthophone one, it, it comes with the orthophone 2M orange from or, uh, MM cartridge. It's not moving oil, even though the turntable is has a balanced output, the cartridge is MM. That's why if you like to use the balance output from here, you have to switch the cartridge with an MC1, it's easy. You just unscrew this here from the tone arm and you can change the cartridge easily. So this is a, actually a turntable. We have the springs here to adjust the level, but we have to, you know, to unscrew these three systems in order to release the sub uh, sassel. Here we have the 44 and 33 RPM selector. It's huge, big, you see here how it's implemented. And all, all these screws here, they're holding underneath that system that controls the speed. Here is the motor and the pulley. Here is the torn arm that is designed in Germany. It's a brand new torn arm from aluminum tube. Thorin's probably is planning to release the, this stone arm as a, an accessory for other turntables, but here it comes pre-installed on this TD1500. Ab they absorb some energy and they isolate the turntable from our rack, let's say. Here we're looking at the internal parts of the turntable. As we can see here, the shaft underneath here, there is a system that controls the speed. This is the sensor that uh, checks the speed and adjusts it uh, accordingly with this electronics. So this is the motor. As you can see, it's a regular motor. It's from uh, Sanko. It's not something special, but does not need a special motor. Since Thorens provides all this system here 
to adjust the speed of the turntable. So here we have the electronics. Here is the output. We provide uh, Thorns provides uh, XLR and RCA output. So we can see it here RCA and uh, XLR. So at the same time, both the outputs are live since there is no switcher to select XLR or RCA. So you can have two phone stages in order to do A B comparison tests, if you like, between RCA and XLR. This is the on off button here this black input there is for the power from the external supply which is this one this pack comes in the box what else we can see the three springs here that we can adjust the level of the you see one spring two three springs you can adjust the level of uh, the sub platter this thing here this gray thing, it's not metallic, it's a, an aluminum, it's a sandwich with, they call it alucobond. It's a special material uh, from aluminum, has no vibration, no reson resonances. So it's a special treated with this, uh, Thorns has applied this uh, material, which is, I think, all the turntable is based on this material because it's very unique and, and works. Conical uh, shape uh, springs. Here is the output of the tone arm, as you can see. So that's all, that's a generic view. These are just for uh, shipping, for transport, transporting. Then we install the platter with the belt, first of all. So we can see here the belt and then if we fo follow this hole of the platter you can see the the, the screw that we can adjust the, with, a, with a screwdriver the spring. Thanks for watching.